surface finishing is a broad range of industrial processes that alter the surface of a manufactured item to achieve a certain property. Finishing processes may be employed to improve appearance, adhesion or wettability, solderability, corrosion resistance, tarnish resistance, chemical resistance, wear resistance, hardness, modify electrical conductivity, remove burrs and other surface flaws, and control the surface friction. In limited cases some of these techniques can be used to restore original dimensions to salvage or repair an item. An unfinished surface is often called mill finish. Surface finishing processes can be categorized by how they affect the workpiece, removing or reshaping finishing, adding or altering finishing, mechanical processes may also be categorized together because of similarities the final surface finish. Adding and altering, blanching, burnishing, case hardening, ceramic glaze, cladding, corona treatment, diffusion processes, carburizing, nitriding, electroplating, galvanizing, gilding, glazing, knurling, painting, passivation conversion coating, anodizing, bluing, chromate conversion coating, phosphate conversion coating, parkerizing, plasma electrolytic oxidation, peening, shop peening, laser peening, pickling, plasma spraying, powder coating, thin film deposition, chemical vapor deposition, electroplating, electrophoretic deposition, mechanical plating, sputter deposition, physical vapor deposition, vacuum plating, vitreous enamel, removing and reshaping, abrasive blasting, sandblasting, burnishing, chemical mechanical planarization, electropolishing, flame polishing, gas cluster ion beam, grinding, industrial etching, laser ablation, laser engraving, linishing, magnetic field assisted finishing, mass finishing processes, tumble finishing, vibratory finishing, peening, shop peening, laser peening, pickling, polishing, buffing, lapping, super finishing, mechanical finishing, mechanical finishing processes include, abrasive blasting, sand blasting, burnishing, grinding, mass finishing processes, tumble finishing, vibratory finishing, polishing, buffing, lapping. The use of abrasives in metal polishing results in what is considered a mechanical finish. Equals metal finish designations equals, number three finish, also known as grinding, roughing or rough grinding. These finishes are coarse in nature and usually are a preliminary finish applied before manufacturing. An example would be grinding gates off of castings, deburring or removing excess weld material. It is coarse in appearance and applied by using 36 a Euro 100 grit abrasive. When the finish is specified as number 3, the material is polished to a uniform 60 a Euro 80 grit. Number 4 architectural finish, also known as brushed, directional or satin finish. A number 4 architectural finish is characterized by fine polishing grit lines that are uniform and directional in appearance. It is produced by polishing the metal with a 120 a Euro 180 grit belt or wheel finish and then softened with an 80 a Euro 120 grit greaseless compound or a medium non-woven abrasive belt or pad. Number 4 Dairy or Sanitary Finish This finish is commonly used for the medical and food industry and almost exclusively used on stainless steel. This finish is much finer than a number 4 architectural finish. This finish enhances the physical appearance of the metal as well as increases the sanitary benefits. One takes great care to remove any surface defects in the metal, like pits, that could allow bacteria to grow. A number 4 dairy or sanitary finish is produced by polishing with a 180 a Euro 240 grit belt or wheel finish softened with 120 a Euro 240 grit greaseless compound or a fine non-woven abrasive belt or pad. Number 6 Finish, also known as a fine satin finish. This finish is produced by polishing with a 220 a Euro 280 grit belt or will softened with a 220 a Euro 230 greaseless compound or very fine non-woven abrasive belt or pad. Polishing lines will be soft and less reflective than a number 4 architectural finish. Number 7 Finish a number 7 finish is produced by polishing with a 280 a Euro 320 belt or wool and sisal buffing with a cut and color compound. 
This is a semi-bright finish that will still have some polishing lines but they will be very dull. Carbon steel and iron are commonly polished to a number 7 finish before chrome plating. A number 7 finish can be made bright by color buffing with coloring compound and a cotton buff. This is commonly applied to keep polishing costs down when a part needs to be shiny but not flawless. Number 8 finish, also known as a mirror finish. This finish is produced by polishing with at least a 320 grit belt or wheel finish. Care will be taken in making sure all surface defects are removed. The part is sisal buffed and then color buffed to achieve a mirror finish. The quality of this finish is dependent on the quality of the metal being polished. Some alloys of steel and aluminum cannot be brought to a mirror finish. Castings that have slag or pits will also be difficult, if not impossible. To polish to a number 8. See also, industrial finishing, surface engineering, surface science, textile finishing. References. Equals notes equals. Equals bibliography equals, Degamo, E. Paul. Black, J. T. Kuza, Ronald A., Materials and Processes in Manufacturing, Wiley. ISBN 0-471-65653-4